I remember how shocked I was one day when I found out just how much bluefin tuna costs. If you haven't heard, the bluefin tuna is one of the most expensive fish in the world and in this episode, we're going to find out just how expensive this fantastic fish is. We should probably start off by describing the bluefin tuna. It is a huge, speedy and absolutely beautiful specimen that can grow as big as a polar bear and travel at speeds of up to 44 miles per hour or 70 kilometers per hour. This is faster than the great white shark or the orca. Bluefin tuna can live for up to 40 years and can reach lengths of 2 meters and weigh as much as 400 pounds. These partially warm-blooded fish can regulate their own temperature, which gives them the ability to travel further than most other fish. You shouldn't mistake this species for regular tuna, which retails at about a dollar per tin. This magnificent species can sell for up to a whopping 1.8 million US dollars for a 489 pound fish. In fact, it was one such fish that sold for that amount in 2013. While in 2019, that record was absolutely demolished when a 612 pound or 278 kilogram bluefin tuna shattered all expectations by being sold for an amazing 3 million US dollars at an auction in the Tokyo fish market. A single piece of bluefin tuna can cost from $80 to $200 per pound, so why is it so expensive? Like we've said before, it's important to differentiate regular tuna from bluefish tuna. Regular tuna comes from albacore and are regular growers that can be hunted by the boatload. Bluefin tuna, on the other hand, is the only type of tuna in the world that can grow up to 400 pounds. This exclusivity is part of the appeal, but the major reason why bluefin tuna is so prized is its exquisite taste. Often referred to as the Wagyu of the sea, Choice pieces of bluefin tuna will literally transport you to realms of mouth-watering pleasure with its blend of balanced flavors when aged properly. Some of the best bluefin tuna in the world comes from Japan. For example, Oma bluefin tuna will cost you about $450 per kilogram. But with transportation costs, you'll be lucky to find it at a supermarket for $400 per pound. If you want to get the best deal, your best choice would be to attend high-end auctions in Japan. The quality of the fish in these markets are tightly regulated by the Japanese government, so you can rest assured that the quality is fantastic and the fishermen will get their fair pay. If you aren't as rich as Jeff Bezos, you may want to avoid the first auction of the year in Japan. During this auction, fish get sold at outrageous prices, either as symbolic gestures or publicity stunts. Japanese tradition holds that the first thing you do in the new year will set a tone for the rest of the year, so I guess wealthy people who wish to start a lucky new year would grab their checkbooks and set records for overpriced fish. This is why you'll hear about 489 pound fish selling for $1.8 million in 2013 and the first fish of 2018 selling for an amazing $323,000. There are four main categories of bluefin tuna meat Kamatoro, Otoro, Chutoro, and Akamai. Kamatoro is probably the best part of the tuna meat that people like. If you've ever had bluefin tuna recommended to you, chances are it was kamatoro. While some people may like it, I find it quite overrated because of the fat content and texture.
Next is Otoro. It is the fattiest part of the tuna outside the head and collar area. It's almost as rare as the Kamatoro and is usually the costliest. Its price can range from 10 to 80 US dollars depending on where the fish was raised or harvested. It has marbling of fat and meat, just like Kobe beef. The next part is the chutoro, which is getting around toward the side of the tuna, and it's a nice mixture of red meat and fat. It's best if you prefer something less obviously fatty than either the otoro or the kamatoro portions. You won't find any marbling of fat in chutoro. And then the fourth part is akamai, which literally means red meat in Japanese. It's the leanest part of the bluefin tuna. It is found close to the spike and is the most common and cheapest part of the fish. Akamai has a lot of umami and sanmi flavor. It's still quite tasty though. However, all is not going well. As we release more CO2, our oceans are becoming warmer and more acidic, putting dwindling fish stocks under even greater pressure for survival. Although we humans love the wild bluefin because of its milder taste and cleaner flavor, we have to understand that climate change and overfishing has driven this delicious fish close to extinction and to even more ridiculous prices. Maybe we have to uh, stop or we have to reduce the eating the amount of the uh, tuna. The future of the bluefin tuna is not so bright. An individual fish can sell for $10,000 or more. Nobody can buy this. However, this huge amount of money promoting illegal fishing and overfishing. <laughs>